हेलो फ्रेंड्स होप आल आर यू डूइंग वेरी गुड टुडे सो लेट्स अगेन टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू एक्सप्लेन सर्वर कॉन्फ़िगरेशन फॉर उडू टेन एंड नाइन एंड इन दिस सेशन आई विल कवर ऑल द स्टेप्स दैट नीडेड एट द टाइम ऑफ द उडू कॉन्फ़िगरेशन ऑन उबंतु मशीन so here are the some points that i i am going to cover on this session so i will start with the purchase a dedicated server so i am going to purchase it on lenode machine so uh, lenode is the server provider so we can purchase from there either you can choose ec2 aws and uh, rack space digital ocean whatever you need you can just purchase a dedicated machine you will get SS ssh access so that we need so let me explain the, this on the lenode machine that is also useful for those guys who do not know about the boeing server on the lenode machine any or any other cloud provider so let me start with so here i just open the lenode website okay so you can see that lenode is the cloud provider you can provide various services uh, but uh, we just going for the dedicated machine so let me click on the pricing section here you can see that having the various plan available 1 gb ram 2 gb ram 3 gb and 8 gb 12 gb and many more in high range uh, sometime user ask uh, how much ram and cpu needed for udo installation so it's totally depend on the how many employee you have uh, suppose if a, a organization having 100 of the employees and 100 employee going to use the udo so i think for work bell we can go for the 4 gb ram and 2 core cpu also uh, it, lenode provide 48 gb ssd storage that is a very good so we can buy this server so we need to sign the sign up even if you have a like a 25 employee you can go with the 2 gb ram that will work well uh, but do not try 1 gb because udo having the large setup and it's take too much ram so 1 gb will not work so at least 2 gb be needed and uh, if we going for the 100 uh, user we need 4 gb otherwise up to 500 we can also choose 8 gb ram uh, okay so let's start with the 2 gb ram okay sign up we need to provide email id username and password actually for uh, this uh, we have uh, already created the account so uh, let me go there uh, if you enter the email id username password it, it will send you link on your email you need to click that link and need to add credit card after credit card added uh, you will get this page okay and this is the by default page as we selected the 4 gb ram you can see there one lenode instance is here that is a brand new plan is this one and ip address public ip address is this location you can select any location near to you like uh, near to india i have selected the singapore location so even for the us and europe you can select your country location for the data storage okay and you can enable the backup and other things let me click over the server so this is a totally brand new and it's not working right now so first we need to build this server so for build server let me rebuild i will select ubuntu 16.04 lts and uh, deployment disk okay that will work swap and we need to just enter the uh, password here so let me enter the password and and let's rebuild the server uh, i i was paused the recording at the time of entering the password so let me go to rebuild it let it's working yeah so 
click on the rebuild okay it's rebuilding the system system initialization is process let's wait few minutes so let mm, rebuild is done and now you able to see all our success hot job queue and uh, if you see the server status that is a currently power off so actually all the setup is done on server int like if you are going to configure your machine on local all the setup you have done but you have not started the server so let's boot it okay so server is booting now and uh, it will start soon so if you are click the remote access you will get the sss access so let's copy it and save okay great so it's done and uh, suppose uh, if i am going to access it let me pause the recording maybe it will take few minutes a server start already so let me try again yes it's work this time need to enter password i have logged into my ubuntu machine you can check this ubuntu uh, 16.04 lts with the genu nail version and all the things are here so in this video uh, actually i have done the installation of and configuration of Linode server and in just after this video i am going to create a new video for all dependency installation here and udo virtual environment those things i will explain here as mentioned here actually installation of python and udo dependency on server udo user and database setup and configuration and virtual environment in the server those things i will cover on the next video okay thanks for watching guys please see next video